Welcome to Samstag Games, the place to find new strategy games and today we're gonna play a game called Evil Cult. We're gonna start this game in normal mode and I'm gonna start my brand new cult, Cult of the Elder God, or as we followers call it, Cult of Arcus's Light. Because I wanna summon Arcus, the Elder God, and let him shine his light on Earth, which usually means destroy completely everyone. And also read you about it. At the dawn of humanity, the great old ones told their secret and dreams to the first men who formed a cult which had never died. Hidden in distant and dark places of the world, waiting for the day when the stars will be right again and the mighty elder god Arcus will rise from his slumber under the deep waters to bring the earth beneath his sway once more. And the name Arcus is from one of my patrons. It is not part of the game. I just want to make that clear. All right. So at the moment, my beautiful cult only has one follower and that is me. And I convince other people through the power of persuasion. There are three main resources that you can use to convince other people to join you. There's intimidation, persuasion, and bribery. I personally generate bribery, so I use persuasion. Sorry, I personally generate persuasion, so I use persuasion to convince other people. You can convert from one ratio to another with a two to one ratio. Now, what we can do is we can try to convince one of these people. So, for example, we've got here Gaston Bouton. Who is a government official? I'm gonna be, hey Gaston, would you like to join my cult? Oh yeah, that sounds really good. Count me in. And we're gonna grab him. So now he has joined my cult. Now, once we sort of spread our, let's say, spread ourselves into the world, we learn about new people who could potentially be interested in joining our cult. So that's why when we click on him, we actually saw this new person here. Up over here, you can see a symbol, and the symbol determines what you need, what kind of resource you need to, to convince that person. So the star is persuasion, the triangle is bribery, and the square is intimidation. And also switch to this other map mode, and here these little sort of um, columns, I guess, show you again what kind of resource you need. And the, if you have a column on the right, like my character has, then it means that they generate that particular resource. It's really important to find people who generate good resources so that you can get more stuff. Now, they're also virgins, so neophytes, which are which is currently just me and this guy, but uh, are, this are like regular followers, they find virgins and we can convert virgins to other resources or use them for special rituals, which we're going to do over time. But first, we're going to end our turn. Over here, we can see turns and awareness. Awareness show how much the society is aware of my cult. So we're going to end our turn. We are now at turn two and we have one persuasion, so we can try to convert somebody. I'm going to try to convert this guy. It's important that you have at least three connections to your main guy or to anybody that generates things, because in order to sort of steal a member who belongs to another cult, they cannot be connected to at least three other people. So that's why it's important that you kind of, I kind of protect myself, because if I'm connected to three people, the enemy cult cannot convert me to their fate, which is good. So we've got a couple of new people. Let me just try to switch the mode. Okay, none of them actually generate anything, so it doesn't matter who we grab. So we're just going to end our turn again. And now we've got one more persuasion. We're going to try to grab, let's say, this guy. All right, we learn about a new group of people up here. Oh, actually, this person, we need two persuasion to get them, and they generate one bribery. So we're gonna try to focus on getting Hannah Meyer, because she sounds good, very good for us. So we're gonna wait one turn. All right, we've got a new sect. Sata Yamazaki, which is me, I have started a brand new sect because it's not enough to be a leader of Arcus's Light. I want another sect called Open Path. So this is really cool. So some of your people, it could be me or it could be other uh, people that you have in your cult, they can create sects. And these sects allow you to do things. For example, if we have enemy cults, we could investigate, we could um, learn information about them, or we could also, for example, there will later on be investigators who try to sort of destroy my cult and my sect can sort of destroy them. So we're going to talk about that more once it happens. I'm not going to do anything this turn because I really want Hannah Meyer, so I'm going to wait till I can get a little bit more persuasion to try to get her to join me. All right, so Hannah's coming home from, from work, from the universe, and I kind of approach them like, you know, you know, they don't value at you at this university. They just, they just don't see you for how smart and important and amazing you are. And I can get you a much better position at a different university. It's going to give you twice the money and it's going to give your kids a great access to great school and it's just, just going to be great. All you have to do 
is you know come to a seminar you know i'm just i'm having a seminar you know just come join me it's just it's fine it's gonna be nothing you know and she goes and that's how we get her let's get her Ooh, and she's mine now she's gonna give me bribery because apparently at this new university she finds a great guy that she falls in love with and he's really rich and now we got money now we got money we can use up all right Ooh, and we've got another we get danielle Ooh, so she's gonna spread the the my cult to other people so we're gonna try to grab this girl very very soon but now it's time to end my turn and let other people do their thing so you can see that now we have generated both persuasion and bribery because we've got her now we need two intimidation which is unfortunately a resource that we don't have so we're gonna have to try to convert our other resources into this to try to get this danielle so we're gonna try to do it let's wait one more turn all right now we've got four persuasion three bribery we're gonna switch to persuasion into intimidation twice and we're gonna try to grab her we did it successfully. It was only an 89% chance, so there was a chance we'll fail. We also have a lot of bribery, so let me try to connect, get David to join me. And also make Kojima and possibly Lena Heinz. Right. Now this increased my awareness quite significantly, which is not ideal because if your awareness is high, an investigator might be might find out about your cult and try to destroy you. So let's first end the turn and see what happens. Well, there was no new investigator, but we started a new new cult. Klaus Heinz, where are you, Mr. Klaus? Klaus, Klaus. Oh, here. So Klaus Heinz, who is an university professor, his name is actually, like his nickname is Klaus, but he actually goes by Robert Heinz. And he started a brand, a brand new sect for me, Primordial Road of Bliss. Oh my God. I don't think you want to know what happens at the sect. You know what? Just like. <laughs> Mr. Heinz, just keep it. Don't tell me what you're doing. I don't want to know, okay? I don't want to know. This this sounds like a weird sect. <laughs> right, anyway, so yeah, so the sects, you can tell them what to do, but you can also let AI do the, do whatever they want to do. In my sect, open pile, we've got 16 people, and in the premier road of bliss, we got 10. Now, at the moment, we've got a virgin, which means we can use some neophytes, three neophytes and a virgin to perform a ritual and get our very first adept. So we're gonna do that. Let's do it. And we've got our very first adept. Now, adepts are, uh, you can use them to lower awareness. So for example, you can send them somewhere and use your persuasion. They're going to be like, go over uh, like to the people like, you know what? There is no call. You know, these people are just spreading lies. There's nothing's happening. You know, just like, don't worry about it. There is no cult anywhere, you know? And so we're going to use that. We're going to use one, uh, one resource to lower the awareness. And now it's going to go down to 8%. This is pretty important because if your awareness is too high, then uh, the, the, um, investigator is going to come for you and that's really really bad so nobody's generating anything here so we're just gonna go and grab whomever so we have one persuasion so let's grab harper hudson and we'll also try to grab we've got some bribery let's try to grab frida heinz Ooh, klaus's wife uh sorry robert's wife robert heinz has a wife was it robert heinz right yep and he was like you know what apparently they don't even live in the same place but who cares and uh, he's like, you know, join me in my group. And she's like, of course, of course I'll join you. Does she know anybody who generates things? No, never mind. Okay, let's end our turn. We now get one persuasion, one barber. We're going to get Donald Stevens to join me. And also, you know, let's get Klaus Unger. I'm going to get some more people. Oh, I should have used it to lower the awareness because 12% of awareness is not great. Yeah, this was, yeah. So we got an investigator. We need to learn about him. Marcel Lefevre. We don't know yet his level and his willpower. And what the investigators do is, first of all, they've got willpower and they increase the willpower over time. So every turn they learn more information about us that increases their willpower. If their willpower gets to nine, it's essentially over. You lost the game. Bye-bye, because the investigator will destroy you. But aside from that, what he does is he will try to destroy your followers. He will kill them. He will straight up kill them. There's no like, you know, I'm just going to convince you to be fine. I just go and I'll just murder them. Which will increase awareness even more because people are like, oh, that guy died. Like, why? What's going on? You know, and they start learning about him. Then they learn that he has connection with some unusual people and they learn about my cousin. That's really bad. So what we got to work on is lowering our awareness first. 
And also, we gotta make sure that we tell our sects to try to search for the investigator. We tell um, Open Path and the Primordial Road of Bliss to search for the investigator. And then we also get School of Power, which is a brand new sect created by David Watson. <laughs> I like that. I like that name. All right. So David Watson is is making our third sect. And now let's end my turn. We actually we've got one bribery, so try to let's bribe somebody. You. Whoa. Okay. So this allows us to learn about brand new cult. This is a cult of the slake. We don't know anything about them yet. Hopefully our AI our cults will try to learn. Yeah, learn about the new cult. I want to learn more about it. Let's end the turn. All right, so this is how it goes. So what happened? We have discovered the existence of the Blooded Mask, which is another cult down here, and also about this cult. Now let me read you about them. We still don't know anything about them. Okay, do we know anything about my investigator? Not yet. That is not ideal. First of all, we need some new adepts so that we could uh, lower the awareness. And we need to learn about my investigator. We need to find out where he is so that we can lower his um so that we can lower his um well power we have bribery and persuasion let's move here to grab some more persuasion and yeah, we actually fail at that we have one bribery but we can't well actually we could use it here so let's do it oh we learned about one more cult there's a lot of cults around now let's end the turn see what happens we still don't know where my investigator is do we He's gained a new level also. Which, so, okay, we now know he's level 2 and he's 3 willpower. And he's stealing my people. So what we're going to do is we're going to try to lower the awareness a bit more. And that's it. And then next time we're going to try to lower his willpower. We'll also tell our sect to confuse investigator. What this means that is that they will lower his chance of stealing my followers it's going to be a bit harder for them they're also investigators for the other cults they're going to try to destroy them as well all right now we can do this we can use our resources to lower willpower of an investigator let's do that we're also going to get another adept a few more because we've got a lot of fortune so we can afford it we have bribery let's lower the awareness still that's pretty good do we know more about the other cults we do we know about the blooded mask those who peer too long into the abyss find that it stares back at them. The blooded mask has long gazed into the ineffable world beyond our own, affiliated with no elder god or perhaps all of them. The blooded mask longs to show humanity the brutal truths that hide beneath, behind the consensual reality. The truth drives those who see them insane, filling them with the desire to show others as well. And the blooded mask are the unvirginal converts. Right. Well, that's rough. All right, we're gonna end our turn. Our awareness is pretty low. How is my investigator? We can't seem to destroy him yet. Let's try to grab this Hanak Gunkel and also uh, Reina Shlangari. Need to connect these guys to the rest of our group. Very soon, let's end the turn again. We're gonna try to lower the willpower of the investigator again. And we'll also try to bribe you this person how are we doing it's he still he still has two willpower but otherwise we're pretty fine let's end more turn i'm gonna lower his willpower again oh we have failed to shatter his willpower that's a bit unfortunate i've got one bribery but i'm gonna keep it i'm not gonna use it actually i'll use it to lower awareness all right again let's try to lower his willpower again we'll grab more adepts and we will Lower awareness. If he can get awareness to less than five percent, he cannot steal any of your any of your nail fights anymore, which is good. All right, let's grab this. Oh, we couldn't grab that guy. That's unfortunate. But we've got the bribery still. Yeah, let's keep lowering the awareness. Now we should uh, have he destroyed him yet? He still has one willpower. It's so not quite there yet. I'm gonna use the virgin to grab a bit more bribery and now we're gonna destroy him. So his willpower is gonna get to zero. He's gone now. There are no more investigators trying to destroy me. All right, now we gotta start working to destroy this little sect over here. I don't like it. I don't like the slakes. I'm gonna destroy them. So first things first. We need to gather information about this cult so that we can destroy it. Otherwise, we can't really do much. So let me tell my sects to, hey, go gather information on this lake 
And in the meantime, we're going to grab a couple of these people. And bribery. Yeah, let's grab this one. No free sources. Okay, we need two farms. So we'll leave him alone. All right. The slakes are making me angry because they're trying to steal my stuff. That's not gonna work with me. I'm gonna steal this guy. We only have one persuasion. Let's grab another one. We'll sacrifice a virgin and we're gonna steal this one. Alright. I'm gonna steal all of them. We've got... This one generates stuff. Three persuasion for this guy. Or two intimidation. Three persuasion again. Let's grab this guy. We got the bribery for him. Ah, uh, we couldn't manage that and he would, would give us intimidation, which would be really, really nice. Let's sacrifice two virgins and try again. Good. So this guy is not going to give me intimidation, which is fantastic. So the next one I could try to grab this guy and protect him from three different directions, which would be very useful. Uh, I'm not going to worry about getting a new adept, I'm fine. Alright, so let's grab this one. Now, this one is protected. Next thing we gotta do, we've got three persuasion, we don't have that. I was going to keep trying to lower my awareness so we don't get a new investigator. And also, so we could potentially... Let's get, get some new adepts so we could... Oh, right, sorry. So I click on the adepts and I got myself a priest. What priests can do is they can start a ritual of summoning the Elder God, which eventually will allow us to win the game. We've got one intimidation. Let's try to grab this guy. No, we don't have enough for that. Let's we'll start with this guy then. 89% chance we grabbed him. One intimidation is not enough to get anybody here. Except maybe... Could we get somebody up here? Yeah, we could get you. Let's grab you. End my turn. Ah, uh, we got a new investigator, I think. Did we? Yeah, Queen Su. So hopefully our sects will learn about it. We got a couple new sects. We got Relaxed Vitality and Gathering of Star. But first, I want to use my Persuasion. I okay, not yet. Not yet. Then use Bribery to lower awareness. And that is it. Alright, now we can do stuff. We're gonna lower the willpower. First we'll grab this one. Aw, oh, we failed at that, really? Then we'll try to grab her. We got it. Great. She's gonna give me intimidation. Then, we are going to use persuasion and bribery to lower my awareness. We're going to get some more persuasion and lower the awareness again. And we'll get some new adepts. End my turn. Now, we have two intimidations, so we're gonna grab this guy. No, we don't, we, uh, well, this guy then. Persuasion 1 is not enough to grab either one of these, but that's alright. Bribery, we could get this guy, let's do it. And we'll lower the awareness again. End my turn. We'll use intimidation to lower willpower of my investigator. He has willpower 4 though, that's rough. We'll get some more bribery to lower his willpower again. Then persuasion, if... Ah, we keep failing at that, that's rough. No, we lost this person. All right, willpower again. Great, that worked. Now how much, I need only one persuasion, so I'm gonna grab her back immediately. Really? I would want bribery, but that's kind of not great. All right, I need you, girl. She, she doesn't want to go. Like, the investigator did a really good job of, of convincing her that, like, she shouldn't join us. Because he's like, nope. Let's get one more intimidation try to get this person. Nice. And bribery will use it to lower awareness again. We'll get some more adepts. You right, want to lower the willpower of the investigator again. And lower awareness. Now, we need persuasion for these guys. So lower willpower one more time. Lower awareness with Barbary will keep the persuasion and we'll try to convert this one. Good, 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 good. Very good job. Do any of these generate anything? No. But I would like to still destroy this one if I can. So let's try it. Nice. I'm gonna lower willpower of my investigator, lower awareness. And yeah, get some more persuasion. We'll take him over. Now this guy, you need two bribery for him. Let's see if we could get that. Lower willpower of my investigator. How much does he have willpower? Oh, no more. Good. We just destroyed him. Perfect. We need more adepts. Oh, my ritual has failed. So this first ritual, what it does is it would allow me to... 
uh, stop some of the other cults from uh, doing their rituals. By the way, we haven't read about the Slake, and since we're trying to destroy them, we probably should tell you about them. Legends passed down for generations speak of vampires, those who consume the blood of mankind. Little do most know that those stories contain the dim shine of through twisted creatures among humanity, drinking in strong emotion, leaving shattered husk. With the world ripe for the plucking, the Slake want nothing more than to turn it all into an eternal feeding ground. No! I need to spread the light of Arcus and not have people being eaten by you. Do either of these two generate something? Yes. This one does. So let me try to use great. So we're gonna get persuasion now, which is good. It's going to allow us to try to steal some of these. Let's try to get you. Oh, I couldn't get him. How about you? Could I get you? Nice. It's getting pretty difficult to like steal the people from them. I'm pretty grateful the other cults are not trying to, to like attack me because I'm pretty focused on this little war with these guys and it's not easy. It's not an easy war. Do we have an investigator? I think we do. And let's lower awareness with uh, with what? With intimidation doesn't seem like we need that. We'll try to grab this one. We got him and we're going down at the slikes. All right. Let's grab this one with my bribery. We'll turn a virgin into a bribery. Get it? Good job. Any of these generate something? Yes, this guy. I need... Okay, so this one has five links, so we first need to destroy some of the others. Like, for example, this one? Unknown. Not enough resources of need to type. Interesting. Let's grab... Hmm. I should tell my sect Try to learn things about... We could learn about their resources, but I eh, will just let it randomly go. It's fine. We will lower our awareness to less than 5%, which means that it's going to be really difficult for the... for the investigator to do stuff. Alright, we gotta lower his willpower. How much willpower does he have? One. Alright, we could now start the Ritual of Unveiling, which will show all occult origins upon completions. It requires one priest and five virgins. Let's do that. Hopefully we'll succeed. Blood Mask has started the final ritual. A rash of cases of schizophrenia and paranoid delusions become an epidemic. A World Health Organization struggles to understand environmental factors behind the increasing number of psychotic breaks in rational behavior across the world. Another of the rituals the Blood Mask are enacting. The only clue is an increased incidence of individuals trying to claw their eyes out, often babbling about seeing the truth better without them. Ooh, so we gotta try to stop them as well. But I wanna kinda destroy the slakes first. So we need three bribery. So we're gonna use intimidate persuasion to lower the willpower of my investigator. Get some more bribery and try to grab this one. Still need to destroy the links on this one to down to three so that we will be able to actually intimidate him and use the resources that he's gonna give me. We probably need more others. So we're awareness again. Cult of Elder has finished the ritual of anything. All cult origins are revealed. Good. So now we know where everybody's starting. So here is the origin. So if we destroy the origin, it has six links. So first we need to get the links down to low enough, and then we could try to destroy the cult by destroying the origin over here, which would be very nice. But first we gotta grab this one, and then four intimidation for this one, which I could try. The chances are 83%. Oh no, he has four links. Okay. How about... Well, we're gonna have to work on the bribery then. Or persuasion. Oh, it doesn't matter. Oh, uh, we don't need to lower awareness. We're fine. Drown has started a war against me. How dare you? They're up here. Uh, can't really stop them much right now. Let's go. Well, either way, we're kind of over time, I think. So let's end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, run in the comments. You can click on right to watch some digital board games like... Lorenzo El Magnifico or Blocks Richard 3. I'll see you there. Bye bye.